BMW has just patented a new technology that can be a game changer for internal combustion engine cars. This innovation boosts power while reducing emissions, representing a major advancement in internal combustion engine development. This technology, patented by the European Patent Office in August 2024, features a pre-chamber ignition device with overflow openings that connect to the main combustion chamber. A fuel-air mixture is injected into the pre-chamber and ignited by a specially designed spark plug. Unlike traditional spark plugs, this one has several separate ignition and ground electrodes, offering better thermal management and reducing the risk of unwanted ignitions. Interestingly, BMW wasn't the first to come up with this idea. The pre-chamber ignition was used in diesel engines until the 1980s to improve the combustion efficiency at low speeds, reduce engine noise, and ensure smoother operation. BMW revived this concept with significant modifications for modern gasoline engines. This new technology not only aims to improve fuel efficiency, but also reduces emissions and increases power output. Output. Additionally, the advanced spark plug design enhances heat dissipation, preventing pre-ignition or glow ignition under high loads, thus extending engine life. This versatile combustion technology can be adapted to various engine sizes, from small three-cylinder engines to large V8s, allowing BMW to potentially integrate it across a wide range of gasoline engines, improving performance and efficiency while meeting stricter emissions standards. BMW has not yet confirmed whether this patented technology will be used in production models. If it does, experts believe it might debut in the upcoming G65 X5, scheduled for release in 2026, or in the high-performance M variant expected in 2027. While we're on the topic of the new X5, let's take a closer look, as we've just seen some early spy shots. These prototypes show clear influences from the new class design language. Before we continue, consider subscribing to the channel if you like the content. Now, let's carry on. A dealer who recently previewed the G65 X5 shared that the new generation features X-shaped daytime running lights and slim, elongated taillights, giving the vehicle a sporty, premium look. Recent spy photos also reveal a taller, wider, and thinner grille with the license plate positioned lower in the bumper, similar to the new X3. Overall, the G65 and the G95 X5M models will be longer, heavier, and sit lower than their predecessors. Sources who have seen the finalized X5M design describe it as having a mean look. I don't know about the mean look, but the new model does look way different from its predecessor, and it seems that the car enthusiasts aren't too fond of the design. Personally, I actually like it. Of course, it's not entirely fair to judge models based on renders, but they often end up being pretty close to the final design. Inside, the BMW X5 G65 and the X5 M G95 will adopt design elements from the new class models, including a new central display inspired by the new class Vision X concept and a panoramic display. Spy photos show a steering wheel with a flat top and bottom. The interior will feature BMW's latest operating system, likely called iDrive X or iDrive 10 with fewer physical buttons. There are also rumors of an optional screen for the front passenger. As for the powertrain, it's confirmed that BMW will use the S68 V8 engine, although it's unclear if the new pre-chamber ignition technology will be included. The S68 engine has been used both as a standalone power unit and in combination with an electric motor, as seen in the XM and new M5. It remains to be seen which configuration BMW will choose for the G95 X5M. While BMW often spreads the cost of new drivetrains across multiple models, a plug-in hybrid drivetrain could add unwanted weight. The current BMW X5M competition produces 617 horsepower, but the S68 engine could easily exceed 650 horsepower on its own. Unlike the upcoming BMW X3 and its first iX3M model, the G95 X5M will not be fully electric. Production of the new G95 BMW X5M is expected to continue until 2033. However, production planning has become more complex, with model cycles varying in length due to changing market demands. One thing is certain, BMW isn't ready to give up on internal combustion engine performance cars just yet. The upcoming M2 CS is proof of that. This beast is expected to be unveiled later this year, with a host of upgrades to make it even more track ready. The biggest change will be a power boost from the twin-turbo straight-six engine. According to a reliable source on the Bimmer Post forums, we might already know how much power the M2CS will have. The user in Golden, who has a track record of accurate leaks, claims the M2CS will make 525 horsepower, a significant jump from the standard car's 473 horsepower. The same source also says the M2CS will remain rear-wheel drive. If true, this power figure would make the M2CS the most powerful rear-drive car in BMW's lineup. 
Though this source has been reliable in the past, it's still just a rumor with no official confirmation. So take it with a grain of salt. Like other CS branded BMWs, the M2 CS is expected to have a stiffer suspension, better brakes, a stripped down interior, and slightly revised bodywork. You can also expect a few unique colors and bold racing stripes on the hood, similar to the M3 CS and M4 CS. There's no word on when the M2 CS will be made official, though a reveal should happen later this year, going by the timing of test mule spy shots from last year and earlier this year, pricing is anyone's guess. Though considering the M3 CS is about 40% more expensive than the normal M3 xDrive, expect the M2 CS to start at about $90,000, but at this point, that's just an educated guess. BMW is also working on a mysterious new model that seems to be a supercar. More about that I explained in this video, so check it out if you want to learn more. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video.